Hi, I'm John O'Rourke. I'm the principal at Taruna High School in Tasmania. At Taruna High School, we have a set of values and the three key ones that I've focused on in my five years here are respect, uh, engagement in learning and a sense of belonging. That sense of belonging, I think, is enhanced by saying to students who may not achieve highly academically or in sporting life or whatever, what can you do? So we um, integrate them into all of our lessons through individual education plans and the IEPs are focused on what those students can do in the Australian curriculum in normal lessons. A lot of time is invested in developing an IEP, a workable IEP, a document that can be used within a classroom. We start with um, getting expert advice from specialists, occupational therapists, speech pathologists, psychologists sometimes. Um, we get in, sometimes it's just information from them, other times they are able to come out to the school and be a part of our meeting. Um, the parents are extremely involved and if possible, um, sometimes the students are involved themselves. Classroom teachers come down and speak and together um, as a collective we decide what's important for that student. And then it's discussed at how these goals can be achieved or worked upon in each classroom and how that, how that will look in a classroom. Our model of integration here at Turner High School means that we've got a learning centre where the students come each morning and they've got a, a, got a base but then they also are off in classrooms as well. So the, the learning centre allows us to have time with the students one-on-one -on -one to practice skills that they can then transfer to a classroom. We've got about 30 students in the entire school on individual education plans and five of those are the girls that we work with in the learning centre. Today, Meg and Laura's class were making biscuits in cooking and it required them cutting out the dough. So be before they went there, we had quiet time in the learning centre without distractions where they were able to practice rolling out Play-Doh and then using cutters to cut out their shapes and put them on a tray. The students therefore got an understanding of what was expected. So when we went to the classroom, they were able to perform the skill with reasonable expertise. For the students who have these IEPs, I'm just tweaking our practical tasks a little bit. Uh, today for example when they came to class they were able to get straight in and roll it out and cut it out into shapes and bake it. We can do everyday numeracy skills, we can do everyday routines, we can do social skills, communication skills, skills in a real life purposeful context. So the teachers value the IEP as a document that can actually be used in the classroom for these students. Um, they trust in the process and they can see the outcomes. We've got some fantastic outcomes from students achieving goals. For us, the IEPs give us a much better indication um, of what the students are capable of and what they're, they're aiming for and I guess expectations of what they can do within the classroom. And we're consciously talking about these students and how we can adapt projects such as the one Taylor's doing She's initiating work now, which is really important, and that, that's quite special. And she's making choices for her artwork that are much more sophisticated than they were last year. So each student's got a communication book in which the teacher assistants record information about their day. So it's, the focus is not only, however, on what they've done in class, but also how they've um, moved forward in their achievement of their IEP goals. The parent communication book also includes a copy of the student's IEP goals in the front cover and these communication books are taken with the student everywhere they go. So if a teacher in a classroom wants quick access and a reminder of what the goals are, they can have a look in the student's communication book and that's true for the teacher assistants as well to be constantly, constantly reminded about what the goals are for that student. We do push that value of sense of belonging uh, and we do really reflect on what every student can do and the students uh, we'll seek that out with each other. Um, so when a student's in their class and they're doing group work, they always try to include students in the group. Um, so they don't exclude anyone, they're really inclusive and include students. Uh, and I say to the students as they leave, you may be leaving Taruna in year 10, but you're always part of our community, you always will be, um, because you belong to us.